Hey guys, I'm Janet on occasion, and today we're continuing on that Seema John campaign, and uh, I decided to make it night time. No real reason. Just thought it'd mix things up a bit, you know? Have the campaign map at night time. Just feels a bit more moody, you know? Because we're at war everywhere, and all the sieges, and ooh, little flamey bits. Fire, I think it's called. Uh, yeah, so just a bit more fun, I think. <laughs> just a bit of a laugh. So, uh, right. Um, Strike! So, where are we at here? So, uh, we could uh, continue the siege. That might be a laugh. Let's do that. That sounds like great fun. Sorry, I've had a bit of a break since I last recorded. Um, right. So. Hmm. So, yeah, we've got a lot to deal with right now. Um, and, yeah, we've got a lot to deal with. I'm not entirely sure we should play this. And there's that nonsense that's going on here, where I have half an army missing. It's really weird. I don't know. I don't get what's going on there. Um, what I am thinking, I had to think that actually I might peace out with the Jin Empire. It is annoying not to consolidate this, right? To actually get these two captured and, you know, be able to uh, just have our borders, you know, an obvious border. I mean, right now this is really annoying. But uh, yeah, I think it might be worth actually ducking out the fight with the Jin Empire. It means I can bring these two armies up here, and then I can start carving a path into, um, well, all of this territory, you know? Because if I can consolidate all of this, that would be pretty good. You know, the Jin Empire aren't hanging out around here. At least I don't think so. Yeah, they don't have anything on this border. Um, also, it means we can complete uh, Luo Yang as well, if we take this. And if you guys remember... Um, my... Actually, I think it was the He Yi campaign and the uh, Xianjiang campaign. I think in both of those, I just had people sat here forever just farming people from ambushing. It was brilliant. We managed to hold off an entire inv invasion from just here. Um, it's just such a great choke point if people are at war with you over this way because they will always just funnel to the nearest city and it'll always be this one because it just juts out so much more to this way than the rest of your empire. So it's just a great way to be able to defend an entire empire just with one city. Um, you can just have like one army there just constantly ambushing things. Maybe we'll do two just to be safe, but that's basically what you need to do. Um, just hang out there, so that'll keep us safe from this side, and we can start eating into some of the vassals. But the Jin Empire are going to be a problem, and actually this little alliance at the top is doing quite well. You know, they are holding the Jin Empire off quite well at the moment, but that could be because there are like two full stacks just trying to make sure that I'm not going to invade them anytime soon. So... There's pros and cons here, for sure. There's oh, definitely severe. pros and cons here, but I think it might be worth just coming back this way. I think it might. Um, what I might do is actually... Say, hmm, let's just see what they think about if it. Because I think, I think I need to get peace with them. So, plus 12, which isn't too, too bad. I think I might just see if I can up our income from it. Um, yeah, request regular payments. It's a shame... Because I have enjoyed just this big war, but I feel like we've made mad gains. Because when you think about it, we took uh, Don, all of this territory from them. Um, there was a big chunk here that we took, and like all of this. So we have taken a huge amount from the Jin Empire. We've probably halved in size. Although it seems like they even have territory over here still. Which is crazy. What have all the other factions been doing to leave these guys so huge and powerful? It's super weird. Um, I just don't see the Jin Empire this powerful in any other campaign. It's really weird. Oh, and up here. Sorry, the Jin Empire are up here too. My god, they're everywhere. See what I mean? They're everywhere, but still, we took a ton of territory from them. So I think we can afford to do it. Um, and it looks like they're willing to pay us quite a bit each turn. Wow. Yeah, a handsome amount, in fact. In fact... Uh, they're not going to want to vassalize. They're massive. Let's give them this as well. And Okay, let's go with 100 Nope Something like that Yeah, the game Okay An extra 50 You know what, that'll do That'll do, I think uh, So, for 10 turns, we get an extra 4 grand I think Very that's well. worth peace I think that's made it worth our while You know uh, I mean, we were getting, what, 500 turn, now we're getting almost 5 grand. It's not going to be for long, so I need to make sure that this goes into our economy, so we can replace that, you know, when we do get, uh, when we, they stop paying us, basically. 
But because we're at peace here now, <laughs> this army that I just got, me, we're going to recall. So our income goes up further. And this, we can fix this later. We can fix this later. We'll have to do another turn, get in there. But uh, we'll have more armies up here. So we get more here, maybe. Deal with, you know, get the rest of Runan. Actually, not the rest, because that iron mine we won't be able to get. Oh. Well, that's a shame. Anyway, we can take this. Uh, we can move up here. Deal with these guys. We have this army free that can move to there, maybe. Uh, I imagine this will get taken, just given the proximity to um, Timaway's vassals here. But uh, I think we'll be in better stead. We've got two full stacks here that can get involved. Which I think is just essential at this point. You know? So let's go over here. And everywhere I go, I'm going to ambush. Except up here, apparently. But, you know. I'm going to try and ambush where I can. And now, let's start upgrading stuff. So, uh, we don't have a huge amount of food right now. So I think I might continue to do food. But I would like to bolster my income a little bit. So, let's go large city. Because that's a big expense. We rarely have the cash for that. Um... I'm going to go income from peasantry, because that's actually earning a fair bit from peasantry, right? Yep. Yep, fair bit. Shame we don't have the spare generals for assignments, but it is what it is. It is what it is. And that copper mine should start paying dividends soon enough, which is nice. Uh, oh, that's the weaponsmith. Sorry, the copper mine should start paying pretty well. Uh, it's a shame that these guys... Hmm. Yeah, I don't think we're going to want to sell that iron mine, are they? Probably not. Hmm. I mean, not really can afford to be buying territories right now, but it's a thought for later, maybe. Uh, right. Okay, I think we're good. I mean, we're not good. We've just started another war with half of China. Uh, I mean, we're not at war with um, Sima Yin yet, but it's only a matter of time. Wow, they actually have territory down there, do they? Yeah, they do. They really get around in every campaign. They just have these little pocket like, empires. It's really weird. That happened in our Tima I campaign as well. He just took a bunch of territory nowhere near him. It's really strange, but... Oh, well. Uh, so, yeah, you head there. You're in the... Okay. Yeah, I think we just have to hit end turn and see what happens. Okay, so Tima Wei look like they're reorganizing the forces a bit. And... Oh? Oh, interesting. We both drown in our people's blood. Uh, alright. Alliance of the... Of the Graceful Crane. So that would be um, Niles, I think, not Fraser. Um, I think Niles was the graceful one. Okay. Okay, yep. Simomo came from Runan. Not quite a full stack, though. Not quite a full stack, weirdly. Okay, so you get in here nice and quick. Um, this army could start heading south. Can't get that far. Can't get that far. I think we need to start setting up ambushes over here first. So, that's 80%, and he should be able to ambush from there. Uh, here, though, I might just have to attack this stack. Because the mountains are covering me, so nothing can really sneak in to get to me here. So, night battle, delegate. Ooh. -hoo. God, the fatalities of the campaign mouth. There. Ooh. They feel so personal. Except apparently it wasn't a fatal stabbing to the neck. So, no worries. Uh, oh, okay. Can't employ her, but we can't release her. So let's do that. Release them. Um, we had no use for let's them. go replenishment. We only lost 300. We really don't need to. Ransom it is. We are not they like it when you ransom their guys. It's fine. So, Reserve now... Uh, only 55% ambush, huh? Oh, 80 there. Always it's not great, forwards. but I just want him hidden, really. Um, but yeah, this, this will be the force that will take this back and hopefully deal with some of these outskirts. Um, also, what I might do, uh, Tima Jiang, I need to figure out where I'm going to bring him back um, once I actually disband him. Glad I remember to do that before I hit end turn. So, recall, selected character. Good. So, we're making a ton of cash, which I'm a fan of. I don't know about you guys, but I'm a big fan. Uh, oh, another thing we could check, actually. Quick deal... Okay, uh, yeah, we do have more trade available to us, but no one else uh, that we could possibly trade with has slots left, which is a shame. Because, yeah, right now, I'm not fussed about 
uh, using trade to, like, mitigate wars. I'm happy to get involved in wars now, because obviously I have an empire now. So I don't mind a tool for that. Uh, I'll give us more commerce cash, huh? Slightly less food. I'm happy with that. Let's do that. Do one of those. Um, let's see. Yeah, more trade income. Brilliant. Uh, this is a weird... Yeah, this is a weird place, isn't it? Uh, he's getting income from, like, all sources. It's really weird. Mo I mean, mostly industry and peasantry, actually. That's putting up... Yeah, that's just a percentage to commerce. So it doesn't actually do anything for us, because nothing is making commerce income. So you may as well demolish that and put something up like industry or peasantry income. There's no point having that. Uh, so let's go ahead and build that up. Let's build this up, too. Uh, don't, can't upgrade anything there yet. Because I ran out of money immediately. Uh, will almost 10 grand be enough? China Maybe. Is people, not its oppressive Hang on. Did I put you in ambush still? I guess I didn't. Wow, that would have been sloppy if someone just come in and attack me. Um, okay, you just need to replenish right now. So he'll be out of action for a little while. But he should be able to retaliate pretty well. Because he had a bunch of cataphracts. In fact, it's almost tempting just to give him more. Very tempted. Very tempted. We'll see for now. Okay. Seem away. Okay. Seem away is coming in. Wasn't expecting that. Wasn't expecting that. Uh, let's have a look at the map. Uh, you know what? Towers suck these days. They really do. So I'm not sure I can really fight this even remotely, successfully. So... I think I'll just leave it. <laughs> I'll take it back later. I'll state control. Doesn't matter. We have, we have control coming out of our ass at this point. <laughs> Alright, see my way is marching across that way as well. So he's in a few places right now. Hmm. Wow. Jin Empire suddenly just going to town. Wow. Okay, with that massive blob of armies, any settlement they get to will lose. So this is this is critical mass. There's no dealing with this for our allies. These guys are just going to get bowled over. There's no hope for them anymore. By the looks of it. Especially because there are enough full stacks guarding their territories <laughs> to defend. Jeez. Oh, I can move her over too. Oh, that's awesome. Let's get that army across. In that case, I will get... Well, I'll be down here. I know... Brothers in arms. Oh, good. Uh, it's been a long time since you've seen your sworn kin. China is vast and the country's needs are many. You've been separated in the name of progress for so long. Upon being reunited, there is little anyone can do to stop you embracing. Overjoyed at finally seeing one another again. Well, isn't that sweet? Um, so, yeah, maybe... Oh, they could reach that pretty quickly. And if the other guys retreated back to Runan, they could get there pretty fast. So I think we might have to put another army in Yanzhou and move it across. When it's, uh, when it's ready. Yeah, let's do that. Just one, one, you know, settlement back. So that'll be a hurdle. Then we can retaliate, take it back, and press on once their army's destroyed. So, Yan Zhou, livestock farm. Sima Zhang. Remain honest. Sima Zhang. Embrace impulse. And let's get a captain. So what do we need? Uh, cavalry, right? Yep, Lance Cav. And China is that's all our money. Hooray! <laughs> We've run out of money. Just as I had planned. Right, let's uh, let's move them up. And let's start getting into better spots. So, okay, that gives us some back. As I know this lumber yard is going to get attacked soon. Uh, I am worried about things coming from this way as well. But we can always move back. Because I want to, I want to get rid of Team Mo early. I think we can just wipe that out as a faction. <laughs> then that would be great. That's that's what I want to do first in this war. Because you know you can only sustain so many. Um, ooh, do I besiege it? No, I'm going to creep up. Okay, I, there's too many unknowns here. It's not like the Jin Empire where I could see all of their armies. I don't know where all these armies are because they're all going to be coming out of various other wars. They could be anywhere. 
So I'm going to creep up, see if I can't catch out an army before I press in. So he's annoying. True folly indeed. Uh, can I get a... Um, military access. No, no, they're not keen. It's like I've been slaughtering them for months. Years, maybe. It's like that's been happening. Right, okay, we're broke. There's nothing else we can do. We're just waiting for replenishment for these two armies. How many turns? Two? Two turns. So two turns and we can start charging. In fact, one turn we can charge in, because replenishment's stupidly high anyway. We get to Yan Zhou. Start getting to Chen. They can start moving up. We're good. It's weird. These are actually being useful to us, because there's just like a an additional faction it's in the way now where are they going oh I wish the Jin Empire was at war with uh, Tsima Wei <laughs> that would be great that way the Jin Empire might not be getting more you know too much extra strength because they'd have additional pressure and uh, both of my rivals would have additional things they'd have to worry about which would be nice okay new dynasty domination or peace oh okay uh, there's always a choice that must be made if one is to achieve greatness. Before you lie to options, foster a network of allies and build a new unified future or exercise your will and bend them to it. Okay, make peace. Uh, or vassals. Uh, hmm. I mean, that just sounds wild, getting extra... Um, and yeah, maximum level of this has no negative effect, so actually just cranking this up to 11 would be wonderful. Yeah, just additional melee damage. The noble support thing is annoying, though. But I think dominate? I think we want to dominate them. Uh, spirit would be nice, though. Uh, but more corruption, and we're probably going to put that up slower than might. Let's do this. Only when we all know who their master is will the realm know peace. New dynasty, domination. Have three factions as your vassals. Eh, we did have two. But that will give us a ton of prestige and plus 50% tribute in diplomacy. That's very cool. And more might. And more might alignment, which will put us to the next level. Which is very cool. Power over others is the only true power. You must endeavor to have that control over those who oppose you, who would oppose you, and even those who do not. Only then, uh, sorry, only when all know you as their master will you be able to end these ceaseless conflicts. Yeah, fair enough. Uh... I mean, I did just get a peace treaty with the Jin Empire. And they paid me for the privilege. That, to me, feels like I don't necessarily need to bend everyone to my will. I just need to fight them for a bit, and then they're game uh, to surrender. Anyway, yeah, we need to deal with this little sod. So, a little concerned about what else might be back there is the annoying thing. So, that will allow us to ambush. I mean, they're just going to take the farmland, almost certainly, but... I'd rather sneak in, you know? Wow. Okay, this is pretty cool. Just got these little river crossings. Completely, yeah, secure. That's rad. Okay, none of these guys have trebuchets, which is so annoying. She does, though. So she should probably get a move on over here, huh? Yeah, she needs to get over here. Yeah, keep moving. I know, right? Gotta reflect. Otherwise, what's the point? Uh, I guess do that one. Why not? Right. Uh, hmm. So we got this pretty well locked down right now. We got it pretty well locked down. With our five armies. Which is pretty good. But again, I'm not sure there's much to do. Except end the turn. I will put up the odd farm. Uh, which somehow, we don't have much food at all. I guess they did take a farmland there, didn't they? Ooh, if they take that one too, that could be bad. We'll see how it goes. Eep. Oh, there's Tima Ai. Tima Ai is on his way. Sorry, not Tima Ai, Tima Wei. Tima Yin, strolling about. Not sure why they're bothering to show me all that. Uh, I'm sorry, Join buddy. Us. I'm sorry I can't, mate. As you wish. Huh, he really likes me. It's just all the damage to the Jin Empire. He was loving it. He was having a whale of a time then. Wish he was still my vassal. That'd be nice. Sadly not. 
Okay. Yep. Yep. Figured as much. But we can crush him. It's all good. That's actually Team of Mo himself, isn't it? That right? Yeah, it is. We'll stay control. No worries. Retaliation is gonna... Gonna be sweet. Okay, good. We lost a place. Fine. Somehow still on eight. Weird. Anyway, uh... So, weather taken for its strategic location, resources are simply to spite us. To spite us. We all know it. <laughs> They're all jealous. Alright, get involved. For hey, mate. The people. For the people. Right, do I... Demand surrender. Strike true. It's worth a try. Should have probably moved him up first, huh? Obey instinct. Let's be honest. Standard right, now stance. you... 80% chance. Good. Aha. Brilliant. Alright, let's put him here. If we can get an ambush on one of these guys, brilliant. Otherwise, I'm going to have to run the hell away. If we don't manage to get an ambush on him. Because that would be bad. But we need that ambush. Um, in order to get a good enough victory that we don't have to worry about there being a second stack there. Otherwise, we're kind of boned. Uh, so he's right here. We're still ambushing. Oh, wow, she could... No, no, she can't. <laughs> like, wow, we can get... Oh, wow, we can. We actually can. Okay, do I just strong arm this, then? Ooh. I don't know. I kind of want to get the ambush first. For China. I really do want to get that ambush first. Because this stuff would be great to wipe out. Just getting an ambush on him, wiping him out, and then pushing in would be wonderful. So I think we're going to continue this maneuver. Um... <laughs> Let's get her doing it too, alright? Everyone's ambushing today. Each step in wisdom. I wonder who will get the ambush. I mean, it'd be hilarious if he spots an ambush, goes, ha, ha, I'm gonna, I'm gonna deal with you, one bow, I see you in the trees, and then suddenly these guys jump on him. Um, good luck. Good luck there. But yeah, hopefully this pays off. This could be risky. For sure. But I'm gonna keep starving them out, because I have a feeling these guys might want to come in to support. Uh, if these guys attack me, I can just wipe them out. A lot easier than if I actually attack. Um, so, great. You know, happy with that too. So we'll see how it goes. But there's, there's a few iffy spots here that I'm not entirely comfortable with yet. We'll just have to see how it pans out. But yeah, I definitely want to get some early victories in with ambushes. Uh, so that way I know that they're going to be down a few stacks and I can start being more aggressive and taking territory. Um, but I, I want to get that advantage first. You know? Trades gained. Fraternal. Oh. A white thoroughbred. Oh. Okay, we got some stuff. Oh, also, someone mentioned this to me ages ago. I need to give this guy um, stockier armor if I can. Oh, he's got the stockiest armor. Never mind. Huh. Alright, I guess it... Yeah, maybe I did it. Or maybe no one knew what he had. I don't know. Um, yeah, I do need to do that mission, don't I? Let's have a look. Diplomacy. Quick deal. Create vassal. No one's game. No, no one's game. No one wants to be a vassal. I guess uh, we'll just have to beat the snot out of the team away and then eventually he'll do it. Ambush failed, but that doesn't matter because he's locked into this fight. Oh, wait, really? None of these are reinforcing. Huh. Well, that's weird. Um. Huh. It's not a night battle. How come these two aren't reinforcing? One of them should be. One of them's in range. I guess not in range of him. Is that it? That seems odd. I figured they were all overlapping and, you know, yeah, we'd have reinforcements. That seems unusual to me. So I could withdraw and he'll keep moving and maybe get ambushed. Stand down. You're going to keep moving? <laughs> it happened, guys. It happened. He was all like, I see you. I see you. I'm not going to get ambushed by you, silly. Yeah, no chance I'm going to let you ambush me. And then I'm all like, yeah, psych. Uh, right, so. Annoy Lou, we only get these guys. A support. And she can't do night battles. Which is annoying. It's very annoying. Yeah. But we do have this army. Uh, I'm just not sure how good this is going to be. The Chi crossbowmen should be able to just melt these cataphracts. They should be able to melt these two... Um, Spearmen as well, actually. They don't have any missile resist. It's just the armor, which won't matter. Um, I am a little bit concerned about how I'm going to deal with Zima Wei and uh, uh, Liu Shen here as well. But 
Apparently we got this, so... Let's give it a go. Okay, right, here we are. Um, what do I want to do? So, she just needs to hide, honestly. I... Although, that's pretty great to have. Alright, so, there are spears there, which is a bit annoying. Uh, a lot of these guys aren't going to be too much of a problem. So, I've got my Lance Cav. I need to deal with them. They can be a big threat. So, how do I deal with them nice and quickly? I could just sandwich them with a ton of stuff here. Which I think I might do. It would be nice just to shoot them with uh, crossbows, though. Alright, these guys. <laughs> can I do that? Is that wise? Or are they just going to kill it to bits? I have no idea. But uh, let's give it a go. Also, uh, yeah, all the G militia. I can, I can worry about them later, I feel. I don't think they're going to be a problem. So let's do that. So yeah, them charging in one way, these charging in the other. Even get into these two infantry a bit, which I think will be wild. Uh, yeah, you lot. Just line up, please. I want you to hit as many units as you can. Oh, you too. There's no infantry back here, is there? Crap. Got some more cavs that can charge into here, but I don't like all these spears. It's all the spears that are scary, you know? So, okay, you go this side to charge into this slot for me. And you guys are both going to go here to push into these spears. And hopefully I can pin this stuff down a bit. My crossbows, on the other hand... I kind of think they should be over here somewhere, helping deal with all this lot. So, maybe I should do that. So you guys go there, and you can blast them. And you... need to sort of hide. Be nearby, so he can't use his abilities, but hopefully you won't die. So, yeah. Oh. Okay. Oh, you need to be in your own group. There we go. And you just hang out on your own. Alright then. Our men are spotted. Okay, you guys start shooting them. This is wonderful. So yeah, this cav is whew, pretty fighty. Yeah, these guys are doing um, a little too well. Okay, they're being a nuisance, aren't they? Guys, come on. Obviously, I want you to go for them. Uh, yeah, go into them. Guys, deal with these guys. Oh my god. They won't die, will they? Uh, crossbow are doing well, though. They're doing some good work. Guys, come on. Okay, good. You keep chasing through them. Excellent. Alright, how are you doing over there? Pretty good, pretty good. Oh my god, guys. Jeez. These cataphracts are kicking the snot out of me. Okay, good. Next lot, please. You go for them. You run in here. You take out Seam away. You guys got a nice sandwich on him, but god, he just won't go. Uh, now, where did they go? There they are. Good. They're holding them back, but not doing much else. Oh my god. These guys won't go down. Okay. Let's have a look. Uh, them next. Okay, good. Okay, good. Uh, yeah, you guys keep hitting what you can. Alright. They're always out of ammo. Jesus. I'm just amazed how well those cataphracts have done against our... Our cavalry. It's very scary. Whoops. No, you don't do that. Okay. Alright, good. Okay, you go for them. Uh... Okay, good. 
Alright, go for him. And you get a nice charge into those, please. Or him, I guess. Yeah, I want you to get the team away. Oh, they're out of ammo. Ugh, crap. Come on. Mess him up. Mess him up. Oh, crap, he just hit me with all of his abilities, because he wasn't close enough. Damn. Alright, into the cataphracts. Oh, took your time. Jesus. Took your sweet effing time. Yeah, he's two infantry. Are no joke. Oh, please get him. Ah, he's running away at least. That's something. Yeah, he's off. Damn. Alright, he got away. That's no good. Okay, good. God, they've just been sat there fighting him for ages, haven't they? He's getting whittled down, though. He's getting whittled down. Okay, on to the next. God, these two infantry are so good. I didn't realize how sturdy they were. But, God, there's no giving up. They do not want to quit. And, yeah. I gotta say, the two spearmen seem to be better than. Uh, oh, good. One step closer well, that, that's to not me. ideal. Seem to be better than uh, my lot. God, all this. All these uh, units would have been lovely a minute ago. Yeah, those cataphracts. God, they, they're just. They surprise me with their longevity. Like, all of their units surprise me. And I've got mostly, like, militia, but. The enemy general still. Is that was no scary. Match. But hey, we basically wiped out Sima Way, and we can follow it up with any of our other two armies while she replenishes hers. So close victory. But yeah, that was uh, that wasn't as clean cut as I thought it would be. Turns out his unique units are very, very sturdy. So yeah, I'm gonna have to watch out for them in future. I can't underestimate them. There's a lot of armor. And yeah, it seems like our Lance uh, militia just can't quite get the punch in, even with a good they surround. A Just not getting the damage strategy. in. Alright, got some gash. Did some pretty great damage. We didn't lose any, so we'll have, you know, maximum replenishment here for her, which is awesome. Okay. Oh, wow. That was fancy. And what's he got? She of the Imperial Guard. Oh, well, you're dead, aren't you? They have nothing to He's going to be very upset. <laughs> Fair weather friend. Oh, dear. What happened there? Is this... Is this be hated by an ex-ally? Probably. That's pretty what that achievement was. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, mate. Uh, replenishment. Yeah. I want I want this force Moving. up and about as quickly as it can be. Because it has a trebuchet. <laughs> and I need that for trebuching. Which is how you say that. Uh, Timmy Yin is walking about. I don't care what his tiny armies are doing. Why Why am I even looking at this? Come on now. It's just silly. Alright, so what's the next hurdle? So this army is annoying. I want to know where they end up. Aha! Superior forces, valiant defeat. i got to say, this is very strange. Um, I don't know if it's just the difficulty is being taken into account, maybe? Um, the difficulty level? Just being like, oh yeah, by the way... Your stuff is better, but they all get a bunch of bonuses, because game. Uh, that could be it. But hey, we got Sima Jian, so, you know. I think how happy he is, to the point where his face doesn't look real. Because he's so happy. Um, yeah, I think we're fine here, right? This should be okay. I mean, sure, we've only got Archer Militia. We really should upgrade his army, actually. And this sucks. Um, having to deal with just mercenary captains or whatever. It's a bit annoying that you're stuck with sort of militia level units. I mean, you've really got to make your own commander stretch. So, let's fight them. Yes. The let's do one of, of those. Blow in our favor. So, weird advantage of this is we'll attack Finally we meet. and shush Finally Simo Mo. You face vengeance. I know you're trying to be dramatic, you know, but I don't really care about you, Timo Mo. You're not that big a deal for me to waste my time. 
um, you know, letting you speak. So, uh, yeah, uh, as I was saying, before I was rudely interrupted, is this will actually have an added benefit of if this army is a bit knackered, then they're more likely to try and get to me. Um, which means running into that ambush that I set. So, that could work out rather well. Weird, huh? God, we have so much cap. And so few infantry. <laughs> Look at this. There's no infantry in this army. So yeah, I need to really make use of our calf in a big way. We go against one army that just has like nothing but spears and we're doomed. There'll be, be nothing we can do. Oh, now that went for See, I hate when this floor. happens. Like, they were your garrison. Why didn't you march out with the garrison? You were in the same settlement. Like, this shouldn't be a thing. This shouldn't be something we have to wait for. You know, I'm being attacked, and yet I have to wait for them. You know, they are the attacking army. Just, it, ah. It's such a weird thing. I don't know why it's a thing. And you know what? Let's, let's actually move up with this lot. Right, you guys, fire arrows. We'll try and set fire to this forest. That'll teach him. That'll teach him. Okay, good. These cataphrags are annoying, though. They're going to be a pain. Uh, a lot of G, but yeah, I'm sure I can deal with them. And now, what are you guys doing? See my mo. See my mo money, mo problems. That's what I've never said in my life. Alright, speeding up again. Oh, you're going to need to move up a bit more, aren't you? I need you to actually be able to set fire to that. Probably move him up a bit more, huh? You just keep moving forwards. Oh my god, what are you guys doing? Alright, speeding things up. I guess just target them and see what you can do. Alright, oh, yeah, they're reforming their ranks. I see. Alright. Uh, boom. And a uh, uh, boom. And a uh, uh, boom. Good. Down there. And, ooh. Getting there. We're getting there. Almost in range. Alright, maybe don't wait there. Okay, good. Uh, no. No. You get involved over there. No, no, no. Locked the groups. There we go. Your best is okay. not good Start setting fire to everything, please. Shut up and die. Good. And yeah, let's just get that going, yeah. A comrade is being attacked. Okay. It's fine. Okay, that's all good. Uh, you actually just fire at will. Attack whatever you reckon. You know, attack whatever you reckon. Uh, so we need to cancel out of that and uh, start chasing them down. Ah, perfect. Ah, good stuff. Yep. Let's do the job. Good. Okay, pin them if you can. You guys doing great. You ruin everyone's stats. Cheers. You go get Team Mo. Uh, you keep shooting them if you can. The enemy warriors are running. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, they do that. Alright, you get out of the way there. You're fighting nothing but spears, but you've kept everyone else busy. So this is perfect. Okay, how's that going? Pretty good. Pretty good. Yeah, they're all really hurt. You start shooting them now. Yeah, you guys could just keep keep going in there. That's beautiful. Yep. You're chasing them down brilliantly. Only wars were won with witty words. 
Oh Someone god, not with the witty words again. You keep going that way. And, oh, there's some spears in there. Oh, how about that? Uh, yeah, you collapse them pretty well. Nice. Alright, keep going. I don't think their leadership is the finest right now. Alright, you keep going there. Sadly, these uh, cheat crossbowmen do get very hurt. So, not best pleased about it. Okay. You guys push in. You go that way. You're doing a fine job over there. Well done. You guys head that way. Oh, no, they were broken. Everyone's pretty broken. Cool. Job's good. Job's a good one. Yeah. Cool. I may as well have been in ambush. That was a textbook. Settle trees on fire with the minute. Envelop the entire back line with cavalry. Rear charge them. Yeah, that was uh, that was good. I like that. That was good fun. But yeah, cavalry definitely did most of the damage there. For sure. Good job. From the roots good job. So that was wild. And obviously all the terror. I always forget about terror. It's just on these units though. But the entire front line that causes terror. And a couple of cavalry. That's uh, that's just silly. That's what that is. Those poor sods. And so his game we've got a fish hat. I'm assuming that's a hat. Uh, replenishment. To the Thanks. task. So yep, that's our farmland again. Offer you peace. Uh, peace offered Take by the Alliance die. of the Graceful Crane. Really? Are you kidding me? They've taken land from me. Oh my god, are you kidding? Ah. Oh. I hate alliances. Why did I join this alliance? That just every time I make friends in this game, it completely screws me over. Every time. Oh my god, that made me so treacherous. I can't say yes. I've lost tons of territory. Oh my god. Fine. Our talks are over. Now I'm at war with nobody. Have we your swords? And there's nothing to do anymore. No, I'm not doing that. You See my Dan. I'm not doing that, Dan. We cannot <sighs> actions. Oh great, they're at war with us. Fair enough. Who are you? Who who even is this? Oh, this game sometimes is so frustrating. Like the wind. Bonus experience. Thanks, I guess. So I'm not at war with them anymore. Oh, I am at war with them. What? Okay, well now I don't understand. Now I don't understand how that worked out. I clearly misread something again because it didn't explain it properly. Not possible. What on earth? So am I at war Get with you or not? I am at war with them. What? I don't understand. So we're out of the alliance war, but not out of this war. I don't understand what's happening. I really don't. I really don't. But these guys are at war with me now, which is annoying. So now I need to get another army down here to deal with them. Ugh. Ugh. Alright, I'll put it in Zindu. Zindu! Fishing port. That's the one. Yeah, let's get her back. Unification she did good. And... Uh, hmm. What's your history? Uh, Tsimergy. For a year. Last year. That seems suspicious. So, maybe not. Ooh, check that out. Hmm. Yeah, let's just get some, uh, some of these losers. Uh... Obviously, archer captain. Always want some archers. Um, she's got her own... She's got her own um, cavalry. But... Do I care? I go Jan sword guard cavalry. Let's do that. That should be fun. So you loiter there and replenish. So we still want with this then? Are we want with them? No, we're not. I'm so confused. So that's going to upset some people... So, okay, I... Were these guys separately? What is happening? I do not understand what happened there. They were definitely in that alliance. Yeah, super confused right now. So, what with them, still, for some reason, but we're not at war with their vassals anymore. Which I feel like I should just declare war anyway, because screw these guys, I want my farm back. Yep. We're treacherous. This is mine now. Thanks. Jerk. <laughs> I mean, seriously, what the hell is going on with these games sometimes? Uh, and I know, I know, all of you guys are shouting at me in the comments because you know exactly what happened. You're wondering why I didn't follow that, but... 
whole alliance war thing. It just confuses the snot out of me. I have no idea what it's trying to communicate half the time. Not at a glance. A lapping tide I mean, it's easy in other total wars. It's just this person you are at war with. They want peace, or they don't. But when you've got a bunch of allies telling you one way or another, it just, ugh. It can get super convoluted and weird, and then you end up with weird things where someone's in an alliance, but the alliance war was cancelled, but you're still at war with them because of prior engagements at war. I don't know. It's odd. It's very odd. You know, it'd be nice if just there was a nice line drawn and I can just get on with fighting. That's why I play these games. It's the fighting. Okay, so replenishment's treated you well. So, I'm gonna get stuck in. Attack. Attack. Continue the siege. Then we're gonna startle him off with another army. With wisdom. Yeah, we're gonna startle him off with wisdom. Now don't move. Oh, wow, he didn't move. What a weirdo. Why didn't you move? Well, it seems like we're going to win regardless, so... Bye? Oh, yeah, that did it. Oh, yeah, he's down. Resilience, though. So he fled. It's a shame. Be nice to kill him. Uh, let's go with the... Uh, I think replenishment and our expands are a bit injured. Eh, not too bad, actually. One is very injured. The rest are kind of fine. Uh, let's go with the money. Release them! Because we do not have very good income. Can't promote anyone. Can't risk it. Although this would be a way that I know they're not a spy, which would be great. But uh, I don't know if they're going to want... You know. Uh, yeah, let's move these guys up too. And what I am afraid of... Is getting to a position where... Ooh, this could work. Uh... Oh, really? It's one of those times? Oh, it's because I'm within range of a city. So yeah, I need to take this and then I can ambush, I think. So, demand surrender. Wow, they're not giving up? Seriously? You see what you're up against, right, mate? <laughs> what a lunatic. Alright, delegate that. Cunning oh. triumphs over brute force. Lost a few. Nothing major. So now... I think I can occupy it safely. Suits our plan. The people's I voice think. cannot be silenced. So there's a little bit of extra line of sight. Alright, now if he ambushes, uh, he might be able to catch the odd other person coming from the uh, from that empire. But still be in support here. Um, what I might do, though, is actually step her out. So, if this place gets attacked, all these guys can be back up and I can decide if I want to do the fight or not. Actually, I won't be able to decide, regardless, because I can't retreat that. So, she may as well stay in here anyway. I don't want her out put him in. He'd be the best person in with all the spear guards, but it is what it is. He's the only one with movement enough to ambush. So, he's still ambushing. I've taken that back. I'm at war with them again, despite the fact I made peace with them by accident or got told to. And then I'm like, no. So, I'm still in this alliance, maybe. I don't really know what's going on, guys. I don't know what's happening anymore. But, things seem to be going alright. We took Nanya. And now we can get the Jade Mine. So that'll be nice. And hopefully take Chen back. We can take Runan. So yeah, he can move that way. He can hopefully finally ambush this guy and deal with him. Though. Oh, actually, I've got my own cataphract, so this should be a lot easier. But we do know that these guys are pretty tough. He's got a lot of these Chu units that are very tough. So I have to watch out for them. Uh, right. What do I want to get now? Replenishment for garrisons. I mean, that's not too bad, but... 50% uh, trade influence is kind of nice. I like that a lot. Um, lower mustering turns is good, actually. And extra campaign movement range. Yeah, let's head that way. Let's head this way. Just keep going. Cool. So this, I might get military infrastructure. I never usually do, but I'm thinking this time, I might as well. Who could tell me doing my SEMA I campaign, but we just not needed it, so... Here, though, yeah, let's, let's play a bit more careful at times, because we are playing more aggressive generally, so we are spreading ourselves a lot thinner. So we'll see how it goes. Oh, there's another army. Grr. Grr. Okay, now what's happening? Nope. Oh. There's that guy we're at war with. And... 
Oh, okay. Now they're going to war with him. I thought we made peace with him. I don't even know. Timo joined war alongside Timo Wei. Of course they did. An exquisite weapon. Oh, good. What did we get? War blade. Oh, that's pretty rad. A ton of extra expertise. Who wants that? Do you want that? I bet you'd love that. Maybe. I don't know. Your expertise isn't great. Your authority is more your thing. And you already have a nice war axe, so never mind. Who might want it? Him. No, not the city. This guy. You probably want one, don't you? There you go. Do you like that, buddy? Also have one of these, probably. Any of these any good? Uh... You know, extra morale, maybe. Why not? There you go. Okay. You get to level up. Night battles, finally. Big fan of that. You have a better horse, too. Which, actually, all seems a bit much. These horses, you know, never mind. They're all a bit too fancy. He's put up cunning. That one does. Alright, you have that. You're legendary now. Uh... Hmm. And one of those. Put up cunning and authority a little bit. Nice. Remain flexible to react with okay. Agency. Now where? We'll head straight to Nanyang. Because these two guys are kind of on their own here. Today. Both pretty sturdy armies, though. If that ambush is spotted, they could crush me. They really could. But I think I need to press the advantage against Tima Mo. Because he's only got two spots left here. And I can reach that in a turn. Excellent. Alright. Night battle. I'm going to starve them out for now. Because I want to scope out the place. Um, so can you reach there in a turn? You can't. Which is a shame. I can ambush Never there always. though. Uh, it's a large town, so nothing too much. But that seems to be all they have. So that's pretty great, actually. So yeah, we might be able to wipe that faction out. I think that's all he has. Uh, these guys, on the other hand, do you want peace? Do you want peace? Why don't you want peace? Make this work. What do you want? You want a copper mine and a ton of money. Alright, I guess I'll have to... Uh, I guess I'll have to defeat you first. Ugh. It doesn't even have that much of an army here. But I guess that's better than this weapon craftsman. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Impossible. It's not impossible. Not if you can imagine it. Yeah, alright, that'll be fine. We'll we'll deal with them in a minute. We could even wipe them out. Because I was actually complaining that we couldn't take a little Poe Yang. So, might be nice just to take them with that army. Uh, so here, I think I might retreat. I actually think I might retreat with him. These two can't get into here quick enough. Uh, it looks like Tsima Liang might be at war with these guys, huh? Maybe? It's hard to tell. What are you doing, Tsima Liang? What are you up to? Do you want to be vassalized? No, it doesn't. Fair enough. Uh, hmm. Not at war with anybody, which is super weird. Tsima Liang just getting on with people. Just getting on with people. So, close victory. Hmm. Not sure. Not sure. Not sure what the game plan is here. Uh, this army, I think, might need to head back this way. See if I can't ambush someone up here, maybe. You know, just try and do something a bit uh, annoying. Oh, it's 22%, really? Yeah, I don't have the movement. Oh, actually, that's 80%. Okay, so yeah, do that. Hopefully nothing will come from over here. What I might actually do is send her back this way. I just leave that unprotected for now. If it gets taken, fine. Cool. And then what I can probably do is take this. So, night battle. Oh, I get a decisive victory, actually. They can join. Uh, yeah, sure, let's do that. Should have fewer losses as well. So yeah, only lost 700. This army's still fine. I might get attacked from a different direction here. So it's risky. It's definitely risky, but hopefully he's... Yeah, he's not really in support there, is he? So it's a little scary. It's a little scary. But that's one more settlement gone, and that'll be the last one I've taken out that faction. Which is good. It's a good thing. But, uh, yeah, these two armies here are a bit annoying, so I do really need to get ambushes with one of these. Um, try and whittle them down so I can take my farmland back, because that is my farmland. You know? But, we've taken two cities. 
as a result of this conquest. So we're still one up. They've, uh, they took two, we took one back and another two. So we're still ahead in this war as well, which is good. That's right, I'm keeping score. I am keeping score. That's how we do. Uh, right, more farms, I guess, because I have some money to spend. So we might as well buy the old farm. It's like we can build much else. Mostly down to my research, actually. I should probably go ahead and build more of something. <laughs> and get some more research so we can actually build useful things. But no, no, I'm not doing that. Okay, it's a war economy, which isn't really... I'm not using it in the right context at all. I'm getting all my money from looting, is what I'm saying. Although that's not a thing. Okay, looks like they're coming this way. Only one. Oh, nope, they're coming back. How many armies are there? Were there three in this area? One moved this way and the other one moved that way. Or do they move that way, panic, and then run back? I think they might have done that. Okay, so this is obviously good. It's fine. Knock yourselves out, guys. So this war, we are one, you know, one nil down, in fact. Now we lost our weapons craftsman, which is annoying, because it was making us weapons. He was crafting them for us. Alright, you head over there. Could be super easy. Take this out, and then we can push the advantage. And probably wipe out the faction within a few turns, so it's not a problem. They're just giving us free land. Uh, or, you know, it's like they've taken out a loan, but with very steep interest. So that's good. Uh, also, you can get over here. Crush them. Small city, which is annoying because it means I have to wait. Demand surrender. They're never going to do it, guys. Nice. For honor. This. It's their last city. That's their capital. They're not going anywhere. Uh, oh, these guys, boy. though, might come in to support. Destroy so what we can do? Oh, it looks like that ambush got spotted. So you can go there. Ah, there is another one there. Okay. Now wait. And you go there. Promote confidence. And he will come down here. No, he can't. I really want to reach other forest, you know. Because if he gets spotted anywhere, he is screwed. But ideally, I want to be in the way here, you know? Because, yeah, I can't... Who actually? Oh. 55%. He gets spotted, he's dead. These two will attack him. It'll be too close to do anything about it. What I could do, though, hide Watch. here. I don't think I'll be in range. Yeah, I won't be in range to stop them moving this way, but I'll be behind them, and I can attack if they're on the road near me. So... Very sneaky here. Start starving them out. Nice. These guys aren't close enough to support. Not quite yet. That guy oh. could get ambushed if he goes this way or this way. Although, actually... Oh. A really? Tide stone. Advancing. Now that's covering the road. Wait. There we go. That should do it. So yeah, any way into this territory, he's done for. But there could be enemies coming from this way. But we can react with this army when we need to. So I'd say that's uh, that's pretty good. Annoyingly though, we haven't taken the Wall Yang like we, you know, promised. But uh, we've been distracted, guys. We've been distracted. Uh, that should be fine. So yeah, okay. Let's end the turn. See what happens. Ooh, Ooh. they spotted me. They definitely spotted me, guys. <laughs> Run away! Oh God, please don't say they're gonna be in range. Oh good, we got away. That's fine. That's fine. Uh, okay, team away. He's just sailing about. I'm not sure where he's going to attack from there, which is a problem. And ambush succeeded. Hell yeah. That's that's what I wanted. Just wipe out one of those armies, and then it's yeah, it's um four v two, which is better, a lot better, you know. So that's good. Uh, what I might do though. Because an ambush is a lot of fun, I think we're going to start the next episode with it. That's right, uh, because we're almost at an hour. We're almost at an hour that I've been recording. So, um, yeah, I'm going to roll this over to the next one so we have somewhere exciting to start. Because, yeah, this, this war is really getting underway. And uh, it looks like we've outsmarted them a little bit, which is nice. So, guys, if you enjoyed this, please do comment, like, and subscribe. And be sure to hit the bell as well. I'm starting to try and say that more often now um, because it's a thing. 
and it's important and stuff, so do that. You know, if you like, I can't force you. I'm not your dad. Um, I'll see you in the next one, son. I mean, guys.